so hi everyone just now a new model for object tracking in real time videos that is samurai has been released which is an adaptation of sam2 by meta and has outperformed sam2 in object tracking so before we jump ahead let's see some of the examples that the team has released and which are looking crazingly good so the first one is sam2 and the second one is samurai so here you will see that once the speed of the moving objects increases and the crowd increase as you can see now sam2 is not able to detect anything but samurai is still able to detect everything so samurai has outperformed sam2 on various grounds as you can see when there are too many objects in the image and when the motion is very fast uh, sam2 is just missing out on everything giving other examples also here is a video from black myth wokong one of the latest games that has been released where you can see that the gameplay is very fast and still even for every second you can see that uh, samurai is able to track down the blade actions when the blade is moving and the motion completely this is just phenomenal looking into the third set of examples a case of occlusion where the object gets hidden behind things in that case also it is able to detect the object crazingly good so if you see this background dancer just move right behind someone and was not visible still it was able to correctly identify that there is a person behind whom it's need to track down so in terms of crowded audience uh, fast moving objects as well as in case of occlusion samurai has beaten everything and looks great on zero shot object tracking so let's try to understand a brief about the model before we compare it with sam2 as well so as you can see uh, when sam2 was released some of the major pain points were a lot of crowd fast moving objects and occlusion when some part of the object gets behind something uh, sam2 struggles on those objects but not samurai samurai is an adaptation of sam2 only but a more refined version for object tracking so what is zero shot visual tracking what is used in the paper they are saying it to be one of the best zero shot visual tracker so it is nothing but uh, able to track objects in video streams uh, without need of prior training on the specific objects so if you like put it on some random video it should be able to work quite smoothly for you samurai employs a motion aware memory mechanism i think this is the key uh, defining point which separates it from the existing models which means that uh, as we move ahead in the video it is able to forget the unnecessary parts from past so for example if the objects are moving in a particular direction it might not require the past from when they are moving in a different direction so something like this which is called as a motion aware memory mechanism here also they have given some examples if you are able to see ambiguous prediction crowded scene with similar appearances considered motion during mass selection so it is able to not now everyone is looking very similar in that case also it is able to perform quite greatly and in case of occlusion like as you can see in the example they have sent i think it would be a little difficult to see there is a cycle or a bike going on near the car but when it goes past ahead it is still able to predict it out but there are some errors going on as you can see once it is completely occluded by it but it is still pretty good not talking out how it works as already mentioned motion aware memory selection is one of their key uh, interesting points that has been included refined mask selection so these are all terminologies that we are not deep diving into for now but just for your reference that you understand okay this is the things that are required if you need you can jump on to a deeper deep dive into the model and real time adaptation and zero shot learning comparing with samurai with sam2 so sam2 is not specifically a object tracking model it's an object segmentation with a lot of general purposes as well but samurai is specifically for object tracking memory management sam2 works with fixed window memory while samurai as already mentioned motion aware dynamic memory so it is able to forget unnecessary stuff temporal awareness sam2 lacks temporal understanding predicts object motion with temporal cues so samurai is able to even predict uh, the object motion and hence is better at tracking the object and error handling higher error propagation refines memory selection to minimize error adaptability as already mentioned sam2 is more generic samurai is more for visual tracking why it is a game changer why the name is going on because it is released just yesterday uh, it has given some great results on accuracy and precision so these are some of the metrics used for object tracking lasort and got got 100k data set there which has increased the metrics significantly 
adaptive adaptability across scenarios as it is zero shot it can be used for anything and good for real world application because as you saw when even when fast tracking fast moving objects are present the results are very good and sam2 was not able to detect in that case it has a great utility here is the architecture for the model a little complicated as you can see here uh, we would be just trying to overview the architecture a bit it processes input video frames through image encoder and extract video visual features so this is a very generic method when we are dealing with multi model data sets or like even with images as well where you extract the image features first utilizes the motion aware memory selection mechanism the mask decoder combines these selected features to generate predicted mask for tracking additionally it refines multiple mask prediction using motion cues so there are multiple things going on a little complicated stuff that we are not deep diving into i need to read the research paper in a lot more detail for that but for now i think there are key features that we have understood for summary and it's worth giving a try uh, the model is open sourced completely and you can use it at github so just search for summary the github repo is available for use and you can use it as it is as well as when i was looking for the the readme the readme looks quite easy to use and eventually you can straight away start with using samurai so i hope uh, you try out samurai for object tracking and let us know how it performs with sam2 thank you so much